I had horrible abdominal pain. Pain in my stomach, pain around my back, pain in my legs. Bei den Ärzten vor allen Dingen darauf achten, wenn, wenn halt jemand kommt mit Bauchschmerzen. Porphyria is an easily misdiagnosed disorder that can cause severe pain, particularly acute abdominal pain, and, if incorrectly treated, sometimes even death. About 1 in 75,000 people carry the genetic defect for acute hepatic porphyria, which is often latent. As the disease is sensitive to hormonal changes, symptoms are rarely seen before puberty, and women are several times more likely to develop symptoms than men. The symptoms of acute hepatic porphyria can include severe abdominal pain, back and leg pain, and an elevated heart rate. These can be distressing, recurrent, and for the undiagnosed, bewildering. As a teenager, I began to have extremely severe abdominal pain, and rapid pulse, and even a little bit of confusion. But this pain was so severe that I'd never felt anything like it. I was doubled over in pain. I suffered from quite severe paralysis, which tend to start around my hands and my fingers, toes and feet, and work its way up my legs and arms until eventually I had complete paralysis. Because the disease is rare and can mimic a host of other common conditions, sufferers are easily misunderstood. An acute attack may become life-threatening due to severe neurological complications like muscle paralysis, including breathing paralysis. It is urgent that patients are diagnosed correctly and properly treated to avoid these complications. Then was the first Vermutung was the Gürtelrose. Hat man den halt auch so behandelt und dann zog das aber weiter. Das ging über den ganzen Brustkorb. I really even stopped going to doctors because it, it made me feel ashamed that they thought I was a hypochondriac. Urine darkening upon sunlight exposure could be a quick and simple test for an acute attack of porphyria. There was one particular doctor that came out to see me and saw the dark urine and said, I, he said, I think I'd like to investigate two things. One of them was porphyria. Early diagnosis is crucial for the effective management of the condition. A family history of the disease can be a sign of its presence in an otherwise undiagnosed carrier. Because my sister had the condition and because we had family awareness, I had genetic testing at the age of 16, so I knew I had the gene. The fact that I knew I had the gene meant that I knew what kind of treatment I needed. Acute attacks are often caused by avoidable factors such as alcohol, a low calorie diet and certain medications. It is essential that both carriers and health professionals check the safety of any medicine. I follow very closely the safe and unsafe drug list. Hormone, keine Hormone, kein Hunger. Porphyria can be severe, but with a little awareness of its symptoms and its treatment, it can be managed effectively to minimize suffering and to help those afflicted lead full and rewarding lives. I think it's important particularly that the doctors know more about it and are aware of it. Uh, testing for porphyria is very important. Porphyria, it, it may be rare, but someone has it, and that someone might be you. If you suffer from acute abdominal pain, test your urine by exposing it to sunlight and contact your treating physician. For porphyria patients, those who know the most do the best. Mm -hmm.